Well, it happened. I burned out. The last video on this channel was in May of last year, May of 2021, and as you may have noticed from the last few videos before that, most of the videos I'd been making over the last couple of years, my own personal interest had just really started to wane. And last year in particular, I worked three different jobs, not at the same time, three different jobs. I started out the year with one company. I had been with that company for about a year before. I worked for another company for a few months, and now I'm with a third company I've been with for almost six months now. It's absolutely been an amazing place to work and has provided some excellent opportunities, but that's not what this video is about. I started making videos back at the end of 2009 talking about Linux, did that for a couple of years, and then in 2012 I moved full-time over to this new channel, which is just my name, it's just Jordan Keys, to talk about tech products. But during that time, I've not only talked about tech, it's not only been phones and tablets and laptops, computers and cameras, things like that. I've also covered quadcopters and drones and 3D printing and all kinds of other things that kind of spark my interest. Unfortunately, the interest in the majority of the tech stuff for me, because it's been 10 years, has really started to wane. When I see a new phone come out, there's a part of me that's just like, ooh, new phone, pretty new technology. Then there's this other part of me that's like, Oh, an another new phone that's a minor step forward that finding the passion to talk about it, finding the passion, to, especially in my case, to pay for a lot of the new products to talk about, to try to stay relevant, just it's hard to be there. So it is time for a change. The tech's not going away entirely. There will still be some tech products here and there. I've actually got a few things like this Lutron Outdoor Smart Wireless Plug that I've been meaning to make a video about for like nine or ten months now. I'm sorry, Lutron. I've also got this Lumen Metabolic Analyzer, which like you breathe into it and it tells you what your metabolism is doing, which as you can probably tell, I could stand to do. I could stand to figure out what I need to be changing about my body to get back into good shape. I've even got some of the new Nest products that Google sent out to me, which was really nice of them. So I'm gonna try to make a video about that too when there is time. And I'd even like to go back and revisit some of the newer Apple devices. I've got the new Apple Watch, the, the iPhone 13 mini. I picked up the Z Flip 3, which has been a really interesting phone but I haven't made a video about it yet. And I've even got this little aura ring, which I'm using for sleep and activity tracking, which I saw on Justine's channel. So there are a lot of tech videos that I would love to make. It's just, I'm not really there to do it because anytime that I have any time available to make a video, more likely than not, I'm gonna go do what I'm gonna tell you about now. Back in June of 2021, I picked up a new hobby. It's disc golf. If you follow me on Instagram, you may have seen me post about it a few times there. Instagram will be linked down below. It's just my name. And that's something that I would really like to incorporate into the YouTube channel. Not as a full-time thing, it's not going to become 100% disc golf. It'll be kind of a mix, you know, just lifestyle, we'll put it that way. So things that I'm passionate about, things that I like talking about, and realistically, am I going to become a professional disc golfer? Probably not. I did register for the PDGA just so that I could start tracking my ratings and stuff as I compete in tournaments. I've only done one tournament so far, but it's a really fun hobby. It's a bit of a money sink. You may be able to tell in the background, I've got this right here. That's a, uh, a net that I can throw discs into and behind it, yeah, right about there, there's a basket that I can practice putting with. And I have been practicing putting and driving and everything here in my office. And actually, I think the next video that I want to work on is related to this little box I've got in front of me. I ordered a couple of these. This is the Disc Mania Mystery Box. One has shown up. The other one will be here later today. And it's just got a stack of different discs in it. If you're not familiar with disc golf, the idea is basically the same as regular ball golf. You know, where you swing a club, you hit a ball. Except instead, you get a special kind of disc. You can get a lot of these at like Dick's Sporting Goods or Academy Sports or on the internet, which is where I tend to get the majority of the ones that I've purchased. You throw it toward a basket and eventually you throw it into that basket. Very challenging, lots and lots of fun. So the black box that I've got there is a box full of nine discs. I have another one coming and I would like to turn that into one other video and just occasionally do things like, I'm gonna go out to the disc golf course. I'm gonna play a nine hole round or an 18 hole round, bring you along so that you can kind of see my progression. You can see the discs I'm using. Maybe you guys can help me out with form critiques. Maybe some of you play. But just as a way to kind of keep making videos, keep talking to you guys, keep hanging out. And I don't think I have a whole lot more to say than that. Let me know your comments, your thoughts down in the comment section below. Again, apologies, so many apologies for just completely disappearing, but I kind of needed the time to, to refresh, to reset, because I went from some extremely stressful job situations to an, an absolutely zero stress job situation, which is how I ended up with a disc golf hobby, to a very middle of the road stress level where I have a decent amount of work to do. I'm not completely overburdened, which means I do still have some spare time, especially during the day, where I can take a few minutes and just talk to a camera. So let me know the kind of things you'd like to see, anything disc golf related, maybe some tech related things, but keep in mind, this channel is not going to be 100% tech anymore. I just don't have it in me. So I guess thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for sticking around. If you're still here, people that are still around from the original channel, thank you so much. That is just ridiculous. 
and I appreciate it. And I guess I will see you again in the very near future, hopefully very near future. Bye guys.